Hey everyone and welcome to this tutorial. Today we want to see how we can build a beautiful looking landing page like this one with the website builder of Wix. I'm going to show you all the basics of Wix, how to use the drag and drop editor, how to upload your own images or videos and how to add new sections to your site or add new pages to your website. And in the end we will connect our own domain to our landing page and publish the website with Wix. Hey, I'm Julie and I will be guiding you through the tutorial today. If you have never made a landing page with Wix before, that's totally fine. You can follow along quite easily because there won't be any coding involved or anything complicated like that. And no matter what type of landing page you want to create, Wix has a lot of different templates for that and I will show you how to get them for free. And speaking of free, one really important thing before we start, you will find the link to Wix down in the description of this video. It's a partner link, so it ensures that you can start your free trial and at the same time you supporting me and my channel with that at no extra cost. So thank you a lot for that. And now I would say let's start and see how Wix works. So when you're down at the description of this video, just click on the first link and it will bring you to this page. And here you can just type in your email address and start your free trial, set up a password, and then you will land on this screen. And this is the new AI of Wix. You can start chatting with it and it will help you setting everything up and add all the functionalities you need, for example, a blog or an online store and things like that. But with a landing page, we just want to collect leads. So I will skip this for now because it takes up to five minutes. And I do have another tutorial on that on my channel. So go ahead and watch this if you're interested, but let's skip this. And now we land in the other flow of Wix and here we can just type in, we want a landing page and click continue. And now Wix is preparing the dashboard for us. And the dashboard is the backend of your site. So you have your marketing here, you have your analytics and of course your leads. So if someone signs up via your form or contacts you, you will have those leads in your inbox and you can also set up payments and manage all your apps, etc., etc. But for now, let's stick to the basics and Wix makes it quite easy for us because they have set up a to-do list for us and we can just start with the first item, design your site. And here we can either have the AI generate a landing page for us or choose one of the templates, which I like a lot. So let's see what kind of templates Wix has for us. And here we can just type in landing page. And now it's important that you choose a landing page fitting your need because you don't want to have a real estate landing page and change everything about it. Every image, every color, every font. It's nice when the template fits your need. For example, if you want to make a webinar, use this one. If you launch an app, use this one. If you are a real estate broker, this is probably for you. You can always click on view and have a look. So this, for example, looks quite nice. So if you have a new apartment to sell, then you can just upload your own images, change the text, change the address, and people can then contact you via this form. And it's a perfect landing page because there's no menu here and no links bringing the visitor away from the page. So that's a really cool landing page. And Wix has a lot of different templates for any use case. Even if you want to sell your own smoothies, you will find a product landing page for that. But if you don't find any, you can also use a blank template. And either you can start from scratch without anything, or you can use a classic template with a headline, and then you can upload your video and have a call to action, either a link or a button below. These are the type of landing pages you see a lot of with course creators. And I do like them because they're very basic and people will be directly guided through the action to click on the link and sign up for for their course. But I want to start with the landing page for a webinar because I think that looks very professional. Then I can click on edit site and it will open up the editor for me. And here we will be greeted by the AI of Wix and we can tell it what we want to achieve with this landing page. So I will make an example here. So I just said I'm Julian Weber and I need a landing page for my webinar on how to build your own Wix website. And I give it a name, Julian Weber dot com for example and then I can click generate site text and now the AI of Wix is 
writing the text for us here. And before we dive in really quickly, you will have all the elements you can add on the left. So you can either add buttons, text or images. You can add new sections to your site, a new page to your entire website. You can change the global design settings here and you can add apps, for example, the e-commerce app or the booking app or the online course app from Wix itself to extend the functionality of your landing page. And we will come to this in a bit and I will show you each element. But for now, let's dive in and here click on zoom in and we see our site here on Wix. And now the challenge is to change everything, but Wix did us a good favor by writing the text for us. For example, here's already in there, join Julian Weber's exclusive Wix website building webinar. And we can just click on edit the text and I would just go with join Julian's exclusive Wix webinar. And you can also change the color. For example, you can make it white, but I think the contrast is not good. So I'll leave it at black. And here you have all the options like you would have in PowerPoint or Word. So you can change the font, the font size, make it bold, italic or underline things. This is straightforward. And you would just do this with every paragraph and every headline. And you can also drag it around. So if you want to have more space here, you can just drag it down a little bit. And then you have a button here. You can also just manage the button by linking it somewhere else. But this button is already connected to manage events. So Wix has its own event app. And here you would set up your own event in the dashboard. So it already added free digital marketing webinar, but you can add your own domain and even sell tickets for that and give it a name, a short teaser text and have the date and everything set up for you. It can be either in your office, in a physical location, online or to be discussed. And you can even charge for the event if I'm not mistaken. So this button will directly guide them through the sign up process. And let's scroll down a little bit. Of course, this is not me. So I would change the image, click on change image. Now I can upload my own media just to show you. It's really cool because Wix has its own free stock photo database and it's also connected to Unsplash, which is a free database for stock photos. But for now, I just want to upload my own and click upload from computer. And now it's uploading my own image. It takes a few seconds and then I can select it and choose the image. And now it's uploading my own image. So I do like that a lot. And just make sure that the text is always within these borders because otherwise the text might not be displayed on smaller displays such as your iPad or your mobile phone. And then we would do the same with a paragraph, just edit everything and make it your own. And here we can also change the elements and have our own testimonials, have our own brand logos, which we worked with. And of course, a good landing page should always have some form where people can sign up or can contact you. And this page is missing this. And we can achieve this by two ways. We can either just click on elements and add text images or even contact forms. For example, I could just choose this contact form and drag it in and then just place the contact form here. So when people land on this page, they can either directly go through the signup process or first contact me with this contact form. But I don't think that's very pretty. So I will just undo this and delete it because we can also add an entire new section and just go on contact. And then we can put in a contact form like this. So maybe down here, we can just pull it in and then people can contact us. And here you would put in the address of your event, your phone number, your email and your social media icons. You can just link them. Just click here and link your Instagram account or your Facebook account and you can add more icons if you have TikTok, YouTube or anything else. And here in this form, people can then contact you. And if you need more information such as their birth date or their URL of their website, you can also add another field here and add this to this. And down here you have the map so you can manage your location. Maybe your office is based in New York. Please type in your real address so it can find it directly. And then the map is directly located in New York. And we can also make it a little bit colorful, change the design and make it a little bit bigger so people will find your location. I know it's a webinar which we're doing here, but let's say we have a corporate event somewhere in our office location. It would be nice to have a map here so people can find you. 
And yeah, this is how you add a new section. And landing pages normally have just one page, but if you would now want to make a website out of it, you can add more pages to it. So you can click here and then just add a menu item and click a new page. Or if you want to, for example, A, B test different pages, you can just duplicate this one. And then you have home two, click this, and then you can hide it. It's directly hide it so people don't see it. If I show it in the menu, you will see a menu item here and people can click on it, but we don't want to have it that people will see it and we can just hide it and we can click on SEO basic here. You can just change the URL and then grab this URL and a B test the landing pages in your campaigns, for example. But generally speaking, a landing page doesn't have any menu items here, even not online courses. So you can also hide this one. They just use the online courses for the sign up process. And yeah, now you would have added all your images and for example, your own logo. Uh, I would just type it in Julian Weber but you can also upload your own logo here and write your story, tell about the webinar, have a contact form, and then it's ready to go live. But before we do that, we of course want to see if it's good on mobile. So we switch to mobile view and then we need to check everything on mobile. So that looks okay on mobile. Maybe we drag it a little bit down so you can read the text. I don't like this one here. So we just need to pull it down a little bit. This is, can be quite cumbersome if you edit a lot of things in your landing page, but just make sure that everything looks good. So now it's fine. You can also just make it a little bit bigger and make the text a little bit smaller or bigger just by choosing this. And you can also, if it's too much text for mobile, you can just hide things on mobile, which is also pretty cool. Yeah, just make sure everything looks fine. This looks good, I think. I don't like this one too much because you can't really see anything from it, but yeah. Just make it your own. You can, as said, hide certain elements. And if it looks good on desktop and mobile here in the preview, we can then go ahead and publish the site. Then Wix will give us a dummy URL, which is julianshomepage.wixsite.com. But if you want to keep things professional, of course, you want your own website connected without wixsite.com in it. Then you would go ahead and connect your own domain. Just click here. Then you can type in your domain, which you want to have. For example, mine is Julian Weber 123 because I have my own website under julianweber.com already. And I have plenty of landing pages built with Wix already. So I'm a big believer and big fan of Wix. But for now, let's keep this one, julianweber123.com. Let's go. And Wix will then say, okay, this URL is available. Then we can click on get it. And now of course we need to purchase a premium plan, click continue. And this is quite nice because we are greeted with a 50% discount. I hope you will see this too and a 14 day money back guarantee. And you will get a custom domain with any of these plan. Of course, no Wix branding and a 24 seven customer service. And if you're starting out with just one landing page, I can recommend you the light plan because you already have two collaborators. So you and your colleague can admin the site. You have two GB storage of space and you get a free domain. And only if you want to accept payments or or have a basic e-commerce functionalities for an online shop or accept payments for your bookings, for example, then you would need to upgrade to the core plan. And here you have 50 GB and five collaborators and also free domain. So yeah, if you have this 50% offer, I would go ahead with the core plan because maybe you want to accept payments in the future. Then you just select the plan, then type in your payment information, credit card or PayPal, and then Wix will automatically connect your domain, which we have chosen before to your site and then you can publish your own landing page with Wix. As said, I have my own website on Wix as well, and I have even a website coaching here in the German market, and I have built this landing page entirely with Wix, and I think it looks pretty cool. I have testimonials here. They can purchase the plan directly on my site. I added like these payment logos here and even a contact form. So I do like Wix a lot, and if you do too, then don't forget to use the link down in the description of this video, which is the first one. Just click on it and then you can sign up for free. And if you're down there, please give it a thumbs up. It helps YouTube to understand that this was a good video. Thank you for listening and see you in the next video. Goodbye.